हेलो एवरीवन माय नेम इज जितेंद्र बाफना ए वेलकम टू माय एजेंट फोर्स सीरीज इन दिस वीडियो वी गोइंग टू सी हाउ वी कैन समराइज द केस यूजिंग एजेंट फोर्स एंड द प्रॉम टेम्पलेट इन प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैव सीन हाउ टू रिट्राइव द केस स्टेटस हाउ टू क्रिएट द केस हाउ टू अपडेट द केस कमेंट राइट इन दिस वीडियो वी विल फोकस ऑन समराइजिंग द केस यूजिंग एजेंट फोर्स एंड द प्रॉम टेम्पलेट सो फर्स्ट स्टेप वी विल गोइंग टू क्रिएट अ रिकॉर्ड समरी प्रॉम टेम्पलेट एंड देन वी विल गोइंग टू क्रिएट a uh, action in the agent force to call that particular prompt template okay so let's get started i will log in into my salesforce organization you can click on gear button and you can click on setup so it will bring this particular screen then you can search for a prompt builder okay so make sure like uh, for creating the prompt builder i already uh, shown in previous video like you need to keep uh, you need to keep, make sure ansty nei and prompt builder is enabled and also the agent force agent is also enabled i have already showcased that okay so once we go to pro click on prompt builder it will open this window and you can just click on new prompt builder then i will just say uh, record summary prompt template then i can just say agent force case summary prompt and i can just say rs rs means record summary this prompt template will summarize the case and what will be the object type it will be case because we want to summarize the case detail next here you can give your prompt as a ai assistant please generate the case summary right the case summary should have description priority reason status case number subject is escalated or not highlight the following case is escalated high high priority case okay or also like that's enough like you know i just want to know this two case okay then and yeah so next thing like i just want like i will just keep it simple it's just for a demo perspective okay and or i can also say and any additional information okay this is simple and now i can just click insert i just want to insert some kind of merge field so i can either select uh, one field at a time right so like case type those kind of thing right but i will just say record snapshot it contain everything related to case and the related account so i will just simply use the record snapshot i have showcased this in my previous video just you can go through that also i can just say you select case type case origin those kind of thing okay just i will save this okay and just say preview you have to provide some case number i can provide this one i just say preview let's see what outcome generated okay so here it generated some out good output but you know uh, it's in the form of bullets and everything so i can just update my you know update my prompt summary must be in form of paragraph and no bullet points okay so let me let me save and preview now it should generate the summary in the form of paragraph so you can see the case is this 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 the quiz was initiated by a phone falls under electricity region of this 
it is due due like whatever the owner of the case is org farm apex and the primary contact is avi green and who can be reached at this additional info including request servicing and product c0 with indication the service level agreement indication of service level agreement violation thank you for your attention for this matter so this is generated i will just say if you want more okay i can say minimum 10 15 lines with multiple paragraph let's see just uh, how the output get changed with the prompts change so here you can see we get some more detail right and it exactly generated the 15 lines right with the multiple paragraphs okay i can just activate this this looks good with more summary then i can go back to my agent force agents agent force agents and then i will select my same agent so service agent okay i can do that then i can open in builder cool so the first thing like uh, i will require one action name like no i will okay i will copy this status action name i will needed this name okay so let me copy this control c i will copy this okay i have copied this and now i can add new a uh, create new action and now i can just say create a prompt template right so this time whatever prompt template i just created this particular agent force case summary that will be my action next let's check here i can just say generating summary that can be my loading text okay this prompt uh, will summarize the case okay which is good enough uh, then see what is uh, input case so this is the case record i will not going to collect from the user right so it has to be uh, generated by this uh, agent force and prompt this one i want to show that prompt response in the conversation just say finish so we have created the action we need to update our topic configuration because we have added the new action we may have to add some kind of instruction here so maybe what you can go back just click here on the topic i will keep it simple instruction so okay uh, generate the summary okay of the case and of the case by using case number and retrieve case record or oh, i simply uh, say generate the summary of the case first retrieve the case record using case number by calling action we can just say which action i have to call i just copy paste this agent post get status by case number right so it can do that okay just save it let's see what happens let me uh, refresh this i can just say what is the status of case 0001019 so it will get the status it's close please provide the summary so it is generating the summary you can see i gave you the loading text right so you can see that loading text here so here it able to generate a summary in the multiple paragraphs you can see that right so let's see mm, let me do one thing okay so uh, leave this i will come back here I want to show you something open in builder okay generate okay first i will start with what is the status of case 00001019 okay generate 
the or I will just add some comment. Add comments to the case. Okay. Thanks you for thank you for resolving the case. Okay, the comment is added. Now I can say summary the case or summarize the case. Okay, it's summarizing the case. Okay, so okay, so it 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 summarize like it open this and like you know it summarize the case. Okay, I can just say summarize the case in paragraph. Yeah, it's fine. Like no. So we got in the form of paragraph is else like we get all the information, and let me see what action and. Okay, so now what I can do, you know, so I I think it's not selecting a right action. So what I can do, I can copy this. Sometime it may happen because it may take some default summarizing the thing. Okay. So what I can do? I can go back to topic action. I can copy this. I can explicitly tell like you know what you need to do. Okay, I can go to topic, and yeah, so this is uh, somewhere I mentioned the summarize the case, summarize the case using action. Hi, what is status of case i will take it another case okay summarize the case yes yeah, see now it has been proper so let me go back and let me do something uh, okay sorry i clicked the wrong So you can tell agent force what are the actions needs to call that is also possible you can define in your instruction so i can just say open in builder i will now just start with uh, summarize the case 0001019 now first it retrieve the case status then it is generating the summary right so yeah now it started see it started uh, generate the summary in the three paragraphs right with the uh, almost 15 to 20 lines so which looks good now like i will just say some uh, summarize the case 00001030 so first it will try to get the status retrieving the case status then generating the summary so because i want the case id so it can get the case id from the retrieving the case status so now it able to generate the summary for you Okay, so that's how you can use a, a record summary prompt template in your agent force to generate the summary of the you know uh, summary of your any any object or any, any anything basically. So I hope you like the video. Uh, if you like the video, please click on like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching.